Welcome back to Sister Circle Live. Now, okay. we recently caught up with the beautiful Eva Marcel of the Housewives of Atlanta. So let's take a look. Our next guest busted on the scene as Eva the Diva, yes. the winner of the third season of America's Next Top Model. And now she's the newest peach holder on Bravo's Real Housewives of Atlanta. Season 11 of the Real Housewives recently premiered. Let's take a look. So you want to get on uh, sit on Daddy's lap? No. Don't sit in my lap, Marley. Okay. Don't sit in my lap. No, don't sit in my lap. <laughs> <All right>. <laughs> <laughs> Reverse okay. psychology. Mike's relationship with Marley is literally beyond words. <laughs> he came in when she was one year old and is the only dad that Marley knows. Beautiful. Please welcome down to the circle the beautiful and newly married Eva Marcel. Yay! Yay! Look at this diva! It takes one to know. Yes. Oh, I you love this hair on you. Yes. I, I, love love you. I love this hair Thank on you. Oh, and then you smell good, honey. Yes. Thank you. Just, oh, that's my shot. mom's fault. She, she doused me before. Doused. I yes. yes. Well, thank you so much, mom. Yes. So newly married. Yes. How's it feeling? Ah, oh, it feels like I have to make dinner every night. Well, yeah, that's for too. sure yeah. now. Yeah. yeah. Before I could skip a couple yeah. nights. Yeah. Yeah. I'm like, yeah, it's okay. Now I'm responsible for yes. the stomach. Yes. Right. Yes. Right. Now, was it like a big wedding? Did you have the wedding of your dreams? Talk a little bit about okay, that. Okay. So. Initially, I planned on having a small wedding. I'm mm -hmm. like, I just want it to be small and just the people that I know and love dearly. But at the end of the day, it ended up being 239 people at the wedding. Oh my yeah. God. There were a lot of, Michael knows a lot of people. Yes. He but knows so a, does Eva. Yeah. I know a couple. I do know a couple. <laughs> yes. And so you had it two was, to three people there. Yes. Everybody else was his. No, seriously. I had about 45 strong. Oh. And the rest were his. Oh. Yeah. Wow. Wow. Yeah. And that consisted wow. of family, mom, dad, everything. Oh, okay. Yes. Wow. Yes. yes. Oh my God. Speaking of very busy. Yes. Mm -hmm. Your life is very busy now. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. You already have a four year old Marley. Yes. Mm -hmm. And now you have a new baby Michael. I do. Oh, the little baby boy is so oh, cute. Oh, he's, 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 he's so delicious. He's so delicious. He's the baby that gives other moms baby fever. Like mm, when you yes, decide, yes. like, I'm done. Yeah. And then you hold him, you're like, oh, maybe. Maybe no. so just do cute. one more. Oh, my God. Okay, so how are you balancing? All of this. I know it's chaotic. chaotic. Prayer and yeah, coffee. Honey, child, <laughs> let me tell you something. My kid's big and it's still too. Listen, you know, growing up, my parents used to always say, it takes a village, it takes a village. Yeah. I'm like, ah. mm -hmm. oh no, it yeah, takes it a does. village, a yes. couple yes. Indian chiefs, a few worker bees. It yes. does. Yes. It really does. Yes. So I'm fortunate. Mike, um, Big Mike, is a great dad. Mm -hmm. And he stepped on the scene with Marley when she was only one mm -hmm. and has gotten her off of diapers because he didn't want to change them. Right. Got her off. Uh, bottles to sippy Aww. cups because he didn't feel like making any of them and so now with Mikey he's just kind of getting into his groove yeah. he's a great dad which helps me out a lot because they're both full-time working parents. And this is his first child. Yes, yes. this is his oh, first that's child. A boy. Wow. Oh, it's, I know yeah. he's. Oh. I mean, how much more yeah. did you fall in love with him? The oh, way yes. he gravitated towards your daughter at that, such a young age. That was, you know what? That was really it for yeah. me. Mm -hmm. I I fell in love with this guy, but there was a part of me that was kind of reluctant until I realized how much he was going to embrace my child. Mm -hmm. And you know, I came from a tumultuous situation prior yeah, yeah, too, yeah. and so someone has to have a lot of chutzpah. <laughs> right. To yeah, yeah. Some, take all of that on yeah. you know I'm a whole huge person with mm -hmm. a daughter and a whole life before him and he came in like a champ yeah. he really did Beautiful. now you have Atlanta housewives you mm -hmm. are an official housewife you got your peach you're down to the, the, the Georgia peach. with your Georgia peach <laughs> <laughs> And at first you were like just, fr you know, friends of the ladies. Yes. So what was that transition like? How did that happen where you transitioned from just being friends with the ladies to like having a whole peach? Well, you know, thank you, Exec yes. over yes. at Bravo that thought me worthy enough to Absolutely. follow my entire yes. life. Yes. Um, you know, last year on Housewives, I was pregnant mm -hmm. and no one knew. Mm -hmm. And I was kind of new to the circle and it's one of those things, you know, before you get to know someone, you're kind of reluctant to tell them everything right, about right, right. your life. And so I didn't really know how to play it yet right but then after being there for a while and being feeling welcomed by Nini and Candy and mm -hmm. Portia um, this season I just came in and was like hey yeah take it yeah. right. I am who I am but if you've always been that person even yeah. way back then we like I said we just we fell in love with who you are where does that realness yeah. come from 
Um, South Central Los Angeles. How about it? <laughs> How about it? Then there's that. Yeah. And then, then there's that. Then you know, that. you never forget where you come from. No mm -hmm. matter how fortunate you are to move up the ladder and to visit places in the world and to be all of these things that you've dreamt of being, you are who you are. You come from where you come from. Yes. And mm -hmm. that rootedness that I have uh, growing up in L.A. And I wasn't, I mean, I, I thought we were like the Huxtables. I didn't think that we were without much. Right. But it, I learned later that my parents just did an amazing job at, raising us and letting us feel like we have everything that we wanted and we definitely had everything we needed. Right, so now as I live in this world and try to figure out who I want to be on screen, I don't forget mm -hmm. who, where I come from. Mm -hmm. And these clothes don't make me, the hair doesn't make me, the makeup doesn't make Message. me. Right. I'm who I am in right. the inside. And yeah. so I think that was something cool to bring to Housewives, mm -hmm. being a hometown real. girl yeah. and just, not you know. Not to say the other days are not real. No, for sure. But just, yeah, having that, that yeah. You can that feel down it. The earth. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, you can feel yeah. it. Uh, you are so awesome. Okay, so we're going to get a chance to know more about you yes. when we return. Yes. And, we and check out her new home collection. You yes, better. Honey, I need some pillows, girl. Yeah. I got you, girl. Yes. <laughs> I got you. We're going to spruce it all yes. Yes. I'm trying to decorate. We decorate my couch. I, I got new. you. We just love Miss Eva Child. She got it all going on. Yeah. 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 Of her interview with the real housewife, Miss Eva Marcio Sterling. Mm -hmm. Yes. yes. <laughs> Mimi's husband Gregory is going through some things. Yeah. How are you guys rallying around them as a family mm -hmm. to just kind of give your moral support? You know, when you go through tragedies like this, I think a lot of times you don't really know what to say. Yeah. yeah. Especially if you haven't been through this particular mm -hmm. type of trial. And so I, I find myself and the rest of the girls just trying to be there for Nini and yeah. Greg. You know, show Greg our support, let him know that we're praying for him. But, you know, my father had a stroke, and I forgot about how much work it took for my mom to mm -hmm. be the caretaker mm -hmm. of my mm -hmm. father. And so with Nene, I try not to forget that there's a lot of weight on her also. Yes. While she's there supporting Greg and being there for him and picking up all of those pieces. Yes. So as friends, we just want to remind her that she's loved and that she's cared about yeah. while we're also concerned with Greg. Yeah. Yeah. I did. So what does this line entail? Because I See, this is very sharp. It is. And I like these little shingles. Mm, right thank here. you, little um, fringe. It's gorgeous. It's it amazing. So good. It's yes. so soft here. Touch, touch. Yes, I will no. touch. Mm -hmm. So yeah. the Even Marcel yes. Home Collection is a little taste on who I am. Yes. And it is very boho chic. It is for the minimalist and the girl that likes yes. a little bit of that's fringe. Me. Yes, that's me too. You need both. Yes. Boho chic. You need boho yes. chic. And so if you see that, it has a very um, soft hand touch, mm -hmm. which is very important to me. Everything that I have. Mm -hmm. It must be of nice hand quality. I so that means it. when you rub it, time. when you lay on it, it's not just beautiful and decorative, but it's actually functional. Mm -hmm. Yes. Now, do you pick your colors um, specifically? Like, do you like earth tones? Do you like bright colors? Or do you have different lines? I have that? different implementations for exactly what you were saying. You said, mm -hmm. it's Thanksgiving time, I need to spruce up my couch. Yes. Yes. And so say you have a very beautiful cobalt one. blue couch, yes. then you need more simple pillows. Right. Yes. And so you dec you decorate with those, but then if you have a very minimal couch, mm -hmm. then you can go a little bit more loud, right. a lot more patterns and colors. And so I have everything from your lame mm -hmm. to I your yes. suede and velvet. Where do um, you get this collection from? Yes. So right now you can get it on even more home.com but it. I'm also doing an exclusive for Evine with sheets and everything top mm -hmm. of bed and then in January you'll be able to get it from Overstock you'll be able <gasps> to get it from Burlington yes. Yes. Super excited about Good. this launch. It is a really big deal for me. Too. I'm gonna give me some pillows, Chad. Multiple I need some for my of yes. revenue. Yes, yes. And I want to have more kids. I yes. want to have more Aww. kids. I want to cook and be at home a lot more. And so, if you can diversify your streams of revenue and find passive well, income, you can sit down and go to sleep and listen. eat while you sleep. And you can Selena mm -hmm. go online and boom, boom, boom. Mm -hmm. Everyone's happy. That's you got cool. new pillows. I got new money. Everyone's good. <laughs> good. Everyone's good. Well, you yes. just absolutely drop dead gorgeous, which we all yes. know. But Thank the you. inside is what matters. And Thank you. you. Are beautiful. Yes. Thank you. Thank you so yes. much Very for being much. here today. Thanks for having Please me. Please make sure you check out The Real Housewives of Atlanta. It airs on Bravo Sunday night. Look for Eva's Home Collection line at evamarcillhome.com. And the conversation always continues at Sister Circle TV and all social media platforms. Eva Marcille, everybody. Yay! Oh, thank you guys so much for having me. So yes. Thank you for coming.